Life ain't gonna give you nothing. I'm nervous for him. We finna separate the man from the boys and the few is going down, man. I'm telling you. Everything you've done at this point, you have earned. Where you going? You quit? What did he quit for? When you put in a good hard day's work, when you put in a good practice, it feels better than that. Shut up! Shut up! Whoever wins this game, man, runs the house. trying to like hit me from behind. McKinney, they hit me late. I'm telling the rest, but they're not doing nothing. They just hit me in the back of the leg, bro. We finna have to scratch after the game. They trash. They're trying to like get extra hits on me and stuff. Like, it's lame. And they know they're not making playoffs. Hey, 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 Get off the field. We doing. Everybody up. Everybody up. Everybody up. Hey, they trying to make us fight them, bro. Like, no cap. Nobody do nothing stupid, bro. We got something to lose, bro. Going to the handshake line, I'm telling my teammates, chill. Just keep your head cool. Bro, don't do nothing stupid. We put 51 on them, and the defense got another donut. Hey, hey, 15, how that turn the L feel? How that turn the L feel? Yeah, all right. Talking all that shit. Hey. Nah, now nah, they want to be humble, bro. They're trying to break the leg a second ago. Homecoming week. The spirit is... Hold on, let me think of a big word. What's a big word for, like... Like, as in, like, it's excitement everywhere. Ecstatic. Ecstatic, that's the word. He gonna be nice and dressed up. Him and his girl. Aha! Right here! I ain't got nothing to do with this mom and dad. Nothing. When this go wrong, I ain't got nothing to do with it. When it go wrong. Out of nowhere, Seth just came up and proposed to Brooklyn. You know, my man, Lil Seth, he over there asked Brooklyn the homecoming. Right now, I'm the only one that got asked on the training crew. Right now. The date. They got, they got they come up. Maybe at This is only the beginning. We got Bryce coming in next. You gotta get the volleyball, right? So I'm on it. Volley two. Oh, she read that. Yeah. 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 She's gonna get a volleyball and maybe at the girl. And it's gonna set you on volleyball. No, what is she gonna catch it? Exactly. Draw her your phone. Put your hood on. Take your hood on. You only got like. Bryce trying to tell me his plan, but I'm trying to tell him. How to really do it. Yo, we gotta three points. This is a game with a three goal. It's three points. Not three zero seconds on the clock. I see Bryce's poster and I'm like, wow, this guy spelled a word wrong. You what does it say? No, don't read it. Tell me what it say. I'll dig it too. I'll dig it if you. <laughs> he can't read. <laughs> no, she gonna my, mama, my mama. My mama. I dig it if you homecoming with me. Huh? Hey, you good? She gonna know. Come on, let's go. <laughs> it's game time. Oh, oh, he was a little nervous at first, so we had to. Bring him back to his senses. Boy, Bro, come here, Graham. Call your mama. He, he nervous. That's, 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 that's Dharma. That's Dharma. He nervous, fam. Come here, fam. He in there with you. He nervous. I'm nervous for him. Wait, let's go. 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 He's gonna ask Starly to homecoming during lunch. So we're trying to get Starly to stay in lunch and hopefully it happens, but hopefully. Hopefully. Because hopefully it's hopefully. <laughs> together. Yeah. We're walking into the cafeteria with Bryce. Yeah. I thought she was about to say no. Everybody just started jumping right because we're happy for the guy. It's just our way of showing them that we have Every week is a homecoming week to me. Every week is a big week. Every week is a big game. 
We have a myriad of, of seniors and, and they don't understand. They probably have uh, probably six, seven, eight more games. And they gotta start taking this stuff serious, man, because this thing is gonna be open the blink of an eye. One thing that we coaches don't like is excuses. And we got some cats in here really trying to get to college and y'all really holding them back. Fagan, what you, what you waiting on? You got off, right? What you waiting on? ULM? You know I know them, right? He has an offer from a particular school. He wants an offer from another particular school, which I happen to know the coaches, and I know they're not gonna offer him. So I'm saying take this offer. You're 100 and what pound? 150. You're 150 pound DB. You want me to do a live phone call right now to see if they really looking for you? Yeah. You do? On camera. Yeah. I want you to go to college. I don't want you waiting on no pipe dream. We're gonna get this over with today. So you know. Hey, hey Big Will, I'm in the coaches meeting right now, man, with, with all the kids on the team. Um, mm -hmm. You coached the ULM last year, right? Right. Do y'all sign corners that's 5'8"? We had them, but I mean, if you're a baller. Cause I, I got a kid right there, he said he waiting on this ULM offer and I'm just trying to justify to see if it's a real look. Yeah, I can call him and ask. Call him right now, dog, and call me right back. All right. Where you going? You quit? For what? What did he quit for? Hey. This isn't going good. Why? Why do that? Don't do yourself like that, man. Because you can't call his bluff and think he ain't going to do it. He was upset because he was embarrassed. We're trying to help you, man. We don't want you stuck with nothing. Everything they saying is right, man. These college coaches are going to go way hard because guess what? They getting paid a lot of money to do what they to win. It's frustrating. It's heartbreaking because you want the guy to realize his potential and what he could be as a, not as just a player, but as a citizen. Uh, and what he means to the community, what he means to his team. Bro, what's up, bro? What's going on, bro? They tripping, bro. I'm really telling Fagan, don't really just make a wrong decision based off emotion. You really want to play the game, so I mean, don't make it harder than what it is. You quit something, you're gonna quit everything for life. You're gonna quit relationships, you're gonna quit responsibilities to your child, you're gonna quit a job or occupation. You're gonna quit on anything. A quitter is a quitter. A quitter is gonna continuously quit with the right amount of pressure. I feel like I need to do whatever I need to do to get back on the team, bro. This, like, this football stuff means a lot to me, bro. So whatever coach need me to do, I'm gonna do it. So he thought about it, and he know how we get down. And he came back in and was very apologetic. This is for the division this Friday, man. This is for the division this Friday. The road to state goes through them, all right? Velvet pants, velvet shoes, velvet jacket. And like, I'm wearing a car. Like, <laughs> some you got a nah. Uh, solo. Yeah, solo, dolo. You hear me a lot? Hey, that's the best way to go, dog. No cap. You can have them just ready when I'm headed to your city. I'm all over my green, you would think I bought a Philly. You playing with the gang, have you dancing like two men? Right, right, right. Always do some scrubbers, that's what I'm gonna do. We fight, we fight, we fight, we fight. Trying to go some time with you. Heavy on the group, I was going by for pound with you. Any given moment, you knew that I was down with you. Never let a tree speak. Maybe I'm so proud of you. Stay up in the store, if you're gonna see you. I done had so many women that I left in the dark. You was a fight in my room, but I let a shit spark. You was screaming out like, bro. Now. They smile in my face cause they cool in my click now Thinking I'ma stay in when they looking at my wrist now It's clean now, yeah Have them bitches ready when I'm headed to your city I'm all in my green, you would think I bought a Philly You playing with the gang, have you dancing like two milli I always keep some snipers, that's from the nitty gritty I was trying to spend some time with you Trying to go some time with you Heavy on the group, I was going by for time with you And it gave me a moment, you knew that I was down with you Never let a tree play me like some time Touchdown, yes, sir. <laughs> Heading into halftime, it's a close game right now. Shoot out. Big 
Big play, run! Big play! Big play! Big homie. I have faith in the defense. They're going to stop We can really live the dream in the papers. We can read about the papers, how we whoop that. we put it away right now. I get hyped, but I know it's an opportunity for us to score, so we gotta hurry up and get out there. I hate playing in the mud. I can't hold on to the ball, cause all the mud on it. I'm scrambling, then I just find Weaver and just throw it to him. Weaver. Ball game, game over, baby. Number one. Let's handle your business, man, at home. Let's handle your business at school. And let's be good people. When the last time y'all walked over there and told your parents thank you, man? I might reconsider what college I'm going to off this, because this weather is a fool right now. One, two, three, family. I can't even talk anymore. It's too cold out here. I gotta warm up. Bye. This is nothing compared to our game field. Take practice more serious. Hey, so let's hit it. This is the haunted house. Here we go! Come on. Where else do they really be chilling with the athletes, hanging with the athletes, eating with the athletes? I'm waiting. It's overtime, the big O, you know? So check out the other rest of the videos right here and subscribe.